All right, so we put a new fuel pump in there and I did pick up a new battery for it. So we've got that in there. We're gonna test it out here, see if it will run and then keep going from there. Just eliminating one thing at a time. As many of you know, if you've been following along, I've got this used day TV to see if I could get it going. I replaced a whole bunch of parts in the process, and in the last video, I got the fuel pump replaced. Today, we're gonna see if it will actually run. Maybe it'll work now. We've got the fuel primed in the system after I drained it out. With the idle slowing down, it means we're still not getting the fuel pressure we need though. Well, we got the other fuel pump in there. It sounds almost the same actually. So I'm wondering if it isn't the in that assembly there. It's got a little pressure regulator. Sometimes those go bad. I'm wondering if I just need to get a whole new assembly. Didn't want to spend that much, but we might have to. Another thing I'm wondering is if the um, fuel injector needs clean because we had that code show up. So I'm gonna clean the fuel injector, check it out, see if it's working fine. It seems to be idles for a few seconds and then it just starts to die out so um, I'll check the fuel injector and maybe that pressure regulator thing in the fuel assembly so thanks for watching guys it does run so I'm excited to get this thing outside and ripping around so we're almost there just a few more things to check on and follow along on this ATV here see if we can get it running around get it out on the trails Subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you guys in the next video.